Guys, in this video, we are going to see how to allocate memory dynamically in C++ programming. Now, to do dynamic memory allocation, we had to use two different operators. The first one is going to be the new operator and the last one is delete operator. The new operator is to allocate the memory and the delete operator is to deallocate the memory so you can free up the space to use other programs running in your system. Now, let's see how we can allocate the memory first. To allocate, we have to use a pointer, the integer pointer, All right? So pointer, and what we're going to do is we are going to store an integer in this pointer. So we are going to equate this one to an integer, and here's where we are going to use the new operator. So new integer, All right? And uh, to see what's the memory we are going to What's the memory location we are going to store this one? Let's see out this memory location. Just see out pointer. Okay. Now you see the memory location. And this is our memory location right now. So now what's going to happen is this integer value, whatever the value, integer value we are going to enter, is going to be stored in this memory, returned memory location. And uh, to store the integer, let's type let's say let's give some number like pointer let's say 36 okay now this integer is going to be stored in the returned memory location and also finally we had to delete this memory so you can use that memory for other programs running in your system so to do that we had to use a delete operator that's going to be delete delete pointer and that's it now this number is stored with stored in that memory location let's see oh there is something wrong let's see integer new integer point okay delete pointer oh I didn't put the star sign in front okay let's see now the number is stored in that memory location and that's how we do dynamic, dynamic memory allocation in C++ programming. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching.